Hi everyone, my name is Colin Hayes and I'm studying Engineering Mechanics and Astronautics here in the College of Engineering. I also have a second major in Mathematics and a Certificate in Computer Sciences. My colleagues and I are excited to be showing you around the Engineering Campus today. I am here in Engineering Hall, which many consider to be the heart of the Engineering Campus, in part because of the many classrooms and resources found within it. Engineering Hall, or E-Hall as students refer to it, houses Chemical Engineering, Civil and Environmental Engineering, computer and electrical engineering, and geological engineering. When we say that a building houses a major, it just means that most of the professors within that department will have their offices in that building, and most of the upper level courses will be taught there too. Behind me is the Huberkst Commons, a lively gathering space that was recently renovated to include more group workspaces. As an engineering student, you'll do lots of your work in teams, so the group work areas in the Commons will come in handy. And, thanks to a recent upgrade, there are even more tables and seating outside too. This space is especially great because it has lots of outlets to charge your devices. Here you'll also find the engineering eatery, which is open most of the day and is a great place to grab a meal or coffee between classes. I'm here in room 1610, which is one of the two largest lecture halls within the engineering campus. There is another lecture hall, room 1800, right around the corner that looks almost identical but is about double the size. These lecture halls are used for a variety of courses that you may be enrolling in within your first year, including statics, dynamics, and general physics. In addition, the building also contains many of the classrooms used for other engineering courses. Beyond regular classrooms, there are also several hands-on learning spaces in professors' research labs in Engineering Hall. Some of those include the Chemical Engineering Labs, the Geotechnics Lab, the Wisconsin Structures and Materials Testing Lab, the Plexus Collaboratory for Computing, and many more. The Engineering Student Development Office is located in Engineering Hall. That's home to several of the services we have to support you including Engineering Career Services, International Engineering Studies and Programs, or Study Abroad, and the Student Leadership Office. Staff in these offices can review your resume and help you prepare for interviewing, help you find an internship or full-time job, help you plan to study abroad, and help you find things you can do in your free time, like joining a student organization or developing your leadership skills. Engineering Hall also contains the offices of our Dean and other College of Engineering leaders.